Let's take a look at what's coming to your big screens as well as your small screens this July. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Matt's Monthly Movies. Mission Impossible Fallout Ethan Hunt returns in the sixth instalment of the franchise. Alongside some new faces like Alec Baldwin and Man of Steel's Henry Cavill, as well as some familiar faces, Ethan is running out of time after a mission goes bad, and as usual, he'll have to pull out all stops to save the day. Ant-Man and the Wasp Following the events of Civil War, Ant-Man is still trying to juggle life as a superhero and a father. But Paul Rudd is thrown back into the tiny suit to face some big action, alongside a newcomer known as the Wasp. But is the Marvel Universe big enough for both of these pint-sized heroes? The First Purge July 4th is usually the time to celebrate all things patriotic, but this year we commemorate the original Purge. The fourth movie in the Purge franchise goes back to its roots and discovers the motives behind the lawless 12 hours that weed out crime and terror in this alternate America. The Equalizer 2 Denzel is back in one of his most recognisable roles in recent times. Based on the 1980s TV series, Washington reigns justice on his hometown of Boston and will stop at nothing when one of his loved ones is under fire. Interestingly, this is Denzel's first sequel film of his entire career. Unfriended Dark Web I actually really liked the original Unfriended. It was super cheesy, but an original take on the horror genre by being a movie completely shot on a MacBook computer. The sequel looks like it's going to be expanding on these ideas and take it deeper into some hidden files on the dark web. Plus, it's getting an R rating, so that's always a plus. Skyscraper just when you thought Dwayne Johnson had exhausted his tough guy protagonist typecast, here comes a crossbreed of Towering Inferno and Die Hard. Johnson is the head of security of The Pearl, the biggest skyscraper in the world, and with it come some monumental security risks, which he alone has to solve. Now, moving over to Netflix, we have some new originals such as Good Girls, Samantha, Father of the Year, and the epic tales of Captain Underpants. Plus, we are getting new seasons of Anne with an E, Orange is the New Black, El Chapo, and Terrace House. But that just about brings you up to date. So tell me, what are you most excited for this month? I'll be chatting with you guys in the comments. But until next time, this is Matt Rogers, and that is all.